Lee, a great afternoon's entertainment out there. And a good win for your boys. Well, we always aim to entertain, but um, you know it doesn't always do wonders for my heart. Really, um, I thought we uh, we started the game really well, played some really good rugby. Um, you know, set a stall out really early. We wanted to run the run the ball, and uh, and take the uh, take the game to Yambre, and that's exactly what we did. And uh, you know, rightly so, we uh, we were twenty one nil up at uh, you know very early on in the game, and then uh, and then we showed our you know weaker side. We uh, we just let. Yarmbury come back at us. They scored just before half time, and then uh, you know, sort of start the second half again. You know, we just had trouble trying to get going again. And uh, you know, credit to Yarmbury because I think they uh, they upped their game as well and uh, came back at us strong and scored a couple of tries and made it pretty uh, pretty entertaining. Um, you know, certainly for the fan on the side. Um, but uh, like I say, you know, we um, we we got ourselves together. We uh, you know organised ourselves. Got a a little bit of a br lucky break with Tom Ratcliffe's try, and uh, you know then the, the rest is history. Really, we uh, we we sealed the game, and uh, we uh, Harry uh, you know scored a, a late try, um, and uh, and that was the game done and dusted. And you know, but you know nobody nobody told you Armbury that that was the case, and they they kept coming and kept coming, and uh, you know ran us close in the end, and almost got a, a bonus. Uh, lo losing tries, so, uh, lo losing points. Sorry. So um, you know, credit to them. You know, they uh, they they also showed you know the good side and bad side of their team, and uh, you know we, uh, we we came out on top this time. It's got to be said that that we seem to fall off when we changed our front row after about half an hour. Yeah, it's. Um, I mean, you know, uh, we, we've got work to do there, and um, we, we we know that. Um, but you know, the the guys are going to have to get a little bit fitter in the front row in order to stay for longer periods of time. So we we, we don't have that um, that happening. So um, yeah, I mean, there is work to do there, and uh, and I think it gave Yambri a little bit of a, you know, a little bit of light. Um, but uh, yeah, work to do, and uh, we'll take that forward into into the game next week at York. I think it is. I mean, there was some absolutely fantastic tackling from our lads this afternoon, and obviously if we conceded four tries, or was it five? I'm not quite sure now, there were so many. Um, some not-so-good tackling, um, but overall a, a, a very, very um, convincing first half, and then we struggled a, a little bit more in, in the second. But uh, in the end... A well-deserved victory and a bonus point winner. That yeah, absolutely. I mean, you know, it's always going to be tough when you you haven't trained collectively for you know a number of weeks. It's always going to be tough to to put a team performance together. So you're always going to get those ups and downs. There's always going to be um, you know people struggling with fitness. Um, but you know, I felt today, you know, it was about you know sort of showing that little bit of resilience. I think we did ease off as soon as we we scored our, our last try. You know that put a lot of space between us and Yarbrough, and I do feel that we we eased off there. With the game was won, and um, you know that kind of mentality is not going to serve as well when we go on to things like the National Cup, where points are going to you know really matter. And um, you know we've just got to get a little bit tougher in the, in those in that particular instance, uh, which we will do because you know we will train um, harder, we will train together, and um, you know we'll, we'll only improve as the season goes on to now. Well done, and we'll see you next week at York. Thank you very much.